we read these words about Samson in Judges 13, 25. And the Spirit of the Lord began to move him at times in the camp of Dan between Zorah and Eshtaol. That word move means really to stir. Uh, the Spirit of God stirred Samson and uh, moved him uh, to do great exploits for God. We know uh, the power and the strength that came upon him through the Holy Spirit as he uh, slew the enemies of God and uh, defeated the Philistines time after time. But we all know the other side of the story where uh, Samson wasn't allowed to cut his hair. Delilah found out a secret and she cut his hair. She tied, got him tied up and uh, as Samson went, went to just uh, throw off those cords that were tying him, it, it didn't happen this time. He was doing it in his own strength. He didn't have the power of the Spirit of God this time. And Samson was a sorry sight as they put out his eyes and as they, as, uh, they, they, they captured uh, this great man of God. But what the enemies of God forgot was that her grows again now if anybody can help me with my hair and give me something to grow it again i would be helpful i'm losing it quickly but listen her grows again and uh, the spirit of god came upon him again and samson did more at the last than he did in his whole life uh, through uh, the, the supernatural power that came upon him through the holy spirit listen Maybe you have had times in your past where the Spirit of God was really upon you and, and you felt the move of the Spirit and uh, something has happened in between. I don't know what it is, one thing or another, and you're just not in the place that you once were. Listen, her can grow again. Uh, the power of the Spirit can fall upon you again. Get in that right place before God. Uh, call upon Him. Uh, cry for fresh anointing and fresh oil and, and a fresh touch of the Spirit. And listen... Uh, you can do great exploits through God, not through your own strength, but through the power of the Spirit of God.